Hello, this is Josh Arias. I uh, just wanted to show you today some things I've been working on for caves in Terraceology. Um, so this is adding some new world gen plugins uh, that you can enable. Uh, so let's create a game with some caves. I'm going to go to our create game sc screen. I'm going to enable our caves module. Caves, double click, or you can hit activate over there too. Uh, hit back, and we're going to start a world. All right, so one thing you'll notice is that uh, by default, nothing's poking out from the earth. Uh, it's actually all hidden underground. Uh, so we're going to cheat a bit, and we're going to go into ghost mode so that we can dive in and take a look at all the caves underground. So this is default settings. Uh, by default, um, kind of scales in caves as you go deeper, so they should get bigger caves as you go deeper. Well, let's bring up our torch. Uh, so example of one of the caves this thing is created. Can get out of ghost mode, I suppose now. <laughs> Send a torch down. Wow, this one actually goes quite a ways. Ow. Yeah. So as you can see, we have you know caves. Big caves. Can throw some torches everywhere, which is kind of fun. Ooh, and that went to waste too. The ever expensive caves. So if we jut out back into swimming in the earth, uh, we can see kind of how how these are arranged. Um, so I've got some other settings also, which uh, should make it fun to kind of play around with. Uh, so let's go over those. Let's exit back to main menu. Go back to create another game. Uh, so we've still got our module selected, caves. Let's go to the details button. Uh, and then down here, so trees, oceans, those are part of Perlin, uh, per, Perlin and uh, flora, humidity, and caves is the section that we care about for this. So we got a bunch of different sliders. Um, Okay, so we have amount of caves, you can uh, scale this up or scale this down. <clears throat> um, then we have this uh, this concept of gradually increasing uh, caves over a bunch of depth. So uh, by default it comes with uh, you know, over 64 blocks going down from the surface. Uh, it'll gradually increase from this value, which is 0.5, to this value, 0.75. Uh, so you should be able to get some interesting things if you wanted to, say, make caves really difficult to find. Uh, you could bring, you know, bring uh, caves in the surface all the way down to zero, so you have no caves at the surface, and then <laughs> gradually increase that over, like, hundreds of blocks or something, which would be ridiculous, but you could. Uh, then also we got height. Um, so this is just kind of just a general scale of how high these things generally are, and then also width. Uh, does obviously the width. Um, also, something you got to play with. Um, there are so many different things you could do with these things. It's crazy. But uh, then also this raw amount, I wouldn't suggest you change it much, but you can play around with it because I put it in there. Um, yeah, hitting preview. It doesn't do much uh, with caves just because it's underground. Um, but let's do a demonstration. Uh, let's maybe just bring caves all the way down to 25%. See the difference from what it was before. All right, and we'll dive back down underground so we can see what it did. So 25%, there's not a lot of caves. We'll just go straight down. <laughs> yes, yeah, would be cruel. That's just a lot of, a lot of d uh, dirt and stone to dig through. The 25% caves are just generally small, generally infrequent. Well, have fun. It could be cool. Thanks for watching.